Court Fest a party. It's gonna be a party. Posted by Keith Murphy, one of the original Free Staters to move to New Hampshire. I think he's currently a state rep. Quote, Last night my Manchester restaurant was burgled for the first time in 11 years of operation. Within seven hours, the Manchester Police Department had the alleged thief in custody. I appreciate their professionalism and efficiency in solving this crime. Great work, MPD. Unquote. He's talking about Murphy's Tap Room, where Free Staters have met pretty much every week for the last 11 years. Most of that's been an event called Tap Room Tuesday. Average people like me uh, built the place, although there were a lot of professionals that helped build it too, I'm sure. And it's really one of the great Free Staters success stories, having now expanded to another town. However, uh, Murphy, I believe, reported some years ago, maybe three or four years ago, that the he, he wanted to expand more and regulation prevented him from doing it or some town prevented him from doing it or something like that. And that's my recollection. In other NH Liberty news, or at least quotables, here is a post from Libertarian Party of New Hampshire on Facebook. Quote, we have heard reports of negligent voter suppression by poll workers in the following municipalities. Unquote. And he lists a bunch of municipalities. Uh, then he says, uh, quote, or they say, quote, we've heard things like the ballots weren't on the table. They were under note paper. Undeclared voters were offered RD ballots, only given L on request. Voters refused an LP ballot because they were not undeclared or libertarian. Ballots were on a separate table. This is not acceptable. The municipal clerks and moderators in these towns are mostly elected, and it falls on them to train their staff. This also falls at the feet of the Secretary of State, who failed to train his poll workers to treat every party equally. Unacceptable. Unquote. And then in response to this, Libertarian Party State Rep. Caleb Dyer says, quote, We will be investigating these claims. The people of New Hampshire deserve to know all of their voting options, and election administrators ought to do everything to ensure this. Those who saw fit to flagrantly violate the election law by concealing options from the voters will have claims brought against them. Unquote. You've probably heard of Porkfest, but have you heard of Forkfest? It's a decentralized alternative. It's also at Rogers Campground at a slightly different time. You don't even need a ticket. Visit ForkFest.Party. It's gonna be a party.